And Jason Portwondo inside Creative Technology, the only Apple specialist here in Burlington. And I know the Christmas season is over, but the giving season continues. That's right, Valentine's Day just right around the corner. This store has something for everybody, no matter what the age. I mean, look at the games here that works with your iPod, your iPhone, the iPad. We'll come over here to the iMacs and check out those, the screen. Check it out, 27 inches. I mean, how fabulous does that look? Make your way down the line, you're gonna have the MacBook Pros, the MacBook Airs. Oh, I'm gonna have a lot of fun, no doubt, on this Tuesday. Talking everything Apple, you're watching Morning Live. Actually Very just cool, shooting yeah. that in that position. That's cool. That's uh, quite a bit of tethering there. I'm under thinking. ice fishing. <laughs> All right, gone fishing. All right, so we mentioned earlier in business the uh, Consumer Electronics Show is kicking off in Vegas later today. But uh, of course, uh, yeah, so we'll call this Nerd Week. Is like, uh, <laughs> so, anyways, uh, Jason's our nerd this morning, checking out some cool stuff for creative Hello, technology. Hello, Jason. Hey, Jason, how you doing? Good morning, guys. I ate. Nerd? Sure, I've been called worse things. So that's fine. <laughs> we mean We're it in the nerds. best way. It's a guy thing. Oh, okay, I appreciate yeah. that. Now, you guys think you've seen some cool things. Wait till we bring you inside Creative Technology. We're joined now by the owner, Dave Walton. And Creative Technology, Dave, has been around for 20 years. Yep. This store, though, has been around for 12 in Burlington. 12 years, that's correct. Yeah. And you guys, the specialists, tell us about that because people are going, what does that mean? Well, basically, it means we know what we're talking about. We've been using Macs, m myself personally, since 1984. Right. That's a long time. Um, a lot of my staff have been using Macs since that day as well. Uh, some of my newer staff weren't even born then. <laughs> so they've been using Macs since, you know, they were in high school or so. So we really know our stuff. Um, we have specialists in the store that can deal with music, video, audio, um, pretty much anything that you're going to do with your Mac. Okay, so we'll get to the music a little bit later on, but first, the iMacs. I mean, you have a 27-inch screen there, and then we have the MacBook Air, the MacBook Pro, so I'll send it to you, and you can describe it for us. Tell us what's going on. Well, the, the MacBook, uh, or sorry, the iMacs mm -hmm. are 27-inch and 21-inch, right? and they're an all-in-one unit. Uh, there's no big box under the table or anything like that, and what you see here is what you get. There's a slot load... Uh, CD burner, DVD burner. There's also a spot to put your uh, secure digital card from your camera. Wow. So they work with pictures really well. And you also have a section over here where you have some used stuff as well. Yeah, we saying. carry used stuff. Right. We're the only place that actually does have used stuff. And it's certified, it's checked out by us, and it comes with a store warranty or the balance of Apple Care if it's still on it. Wow, okay, and then quickly here, let's touch on the MacBook Air and the uh, MacBook Pro. Yeah, MacBook Airs are really thin, they travel really well. Um, ultra thin, ultra light. This is 11 inch and Jeez. it starts out at $999. And then, then you go to the, the we'll 13 go to... inch yep. and the 15 inch MacBook Pro. This is more for pro users or students in school in graphic arts or video editing or something like that. All right, we've just uh, begun the fun here inside of Creative Technology. So much more to discuss on this Tuesday, including Service, yes, you can get service done on whatever you have, your MacBook Pro, your MacBook Air, could be the IMAX, and the best part is done right here inside the store. Keep it locked, you're watching CHCH Morning Live. This program. We are here live in Burlington talking everything Apple on this Tuesday inside Creative Technology. If you need any service done, the best part is that it's one-stop shopping. If you need RAM upgrades, hardware upgrade, perhaps even a little cleaning, your product does not have to leave right here. It doesn't have to get shipped out or shipped back in, so you don't have to worry about any of that. We'll talk with the service manager, Don Nicklin, coming up after the break. More on that following these as we're going to have a little fun here on the computer. So we'll just... Now in Burlington. Yes, Creative Technology. Hey, Jason. Hey, how's it going, guys? Yes, we're talking service this time around, joined by the service manager, Don Nicklin. And you know what, like any other problems that you might have in life, you know, you need to figure out just how am I going to diagnose that problem? What is, is exactly wrong? And 
Let's start with the iMac. If you're having a startup issue, where would you begin in trying to get it rectified? Okay, well, the, the first thing we like to do is when the computer comes in, we get an idea of, of what exactly you're experiencing. For example, your computer, you said, isn't starting up. So there could right. be a number of things that could be preventing that problem. So what we're going to do is we're going to run a quick MRI test. It's going to look at the basic subsystems of the computer, such as the hard drive, the optical drive, the logic board processors. It will tell us if all that stuff is being seen or not. In this case, everything is looking good off the preliminary, but we're going right. to have to dig a little bit deeper. So we're going to try and determine now by running some further diagnostics in the back, whether it's a problem with your hardware, such as a hard drive issue, right. if it's a problem with your operating system, maybe it needs a reinstall or you've got some corruption that's happened somewhere along the way due to a power outage, something like that. We're going to figure that out. And from there, we'll, if it's a hardware problem, we might give you some options such as, oh, you, you need a new hard drive. If you're under warranty, we can have that covered at no charge. If you are uh, out of warranty, we have some options that we can uh, show you as well for that. All right, so the MRI, just like a surgeon, before you go in, you got to figure out what's wrong. Exactly. Upgrades, that's obviously a key thing that can be done to speed up your computer as well. Exactly, and uh, a lot of times people, one of the problems they may have is their hard drive is getting uh, fairly full. Uh, if you bought your computer a couple of years ago, it might have a smaller drive, like a 160 or a 250. Uh, for desktop drives, we have an example, a very popular one, a one terabyte drive upgrade. Uh, it's, it will go a, a fair distance. Uh, some people have a lot of music, a lot of movies with Netflix, things like that. They like to download stuff. Here we have a three terabyte drive that will fit into most Mac desktops. For laptops, we can go up to as high as one terabyte, which is a lot of storage on a laptop. Uh, these things will increase your capacity and give, add a little extra life to your computer. And one other key note for those of you watching out there, keep your computers clean because you've seen a lot of spill damages and that causes a lot of problems as well. We appreciate your time. Thanks very much. Still lots more to come from inside of Creative Technology. In fact, coming up a little bit later on, we're going to have some fun. That's right, kids. Pay attention. We're going to fly the AR drone and look at this little guy here. The big rig, if you will. <laughs> the little monster truck. We're going to show you how to work this with your iPad, your iPhone, the iPod, you name it. More Morning Live after this. I'm Jason Portwondo inside Creative Technology here in Burlington talking Apple, Apple and more Apple. Check this out. It's the AR drone. More on that plus as well a little bit of the monster truck action as the kids will have some fun as well. Stay with us. Your mother's words, they're, they're ringing still. Weeknights on CHCH. The Insider gets you closer as we go one on one with Hollywood's biggest star. On the arm from the uh, latest uh, version of the playbook after yep. a, a rough 2011. But of course, this is the year where so many new products are being showcased in Vegas later at the Consumer Electronics Show. And there'll be much more on that on Morning Live. But right now, we're at Creative Technology in Burlington with some very cool stuff. Hello, Jason. I love that hovering thing we saw earlier. Awesome. It's got a camera on it as well, oh. guys. Maybe I'll try and bring one back for you. <laughs> It's kind of pricey. We'll have to see. But you know what? The kids are just getting up, so this is perfect timing to talk about some fun stuff. Joined once again by Dave Walton, the owner of Creative Technology, and Tyler Lucas, a Cervic technician. Uh, we got to talk about the drone. We got to fly this thing and show yep. the people what it Let's can go. do, Dave. Here we, here we go. All right. It's controlled by the iPad or iPod or I, I, iPhone. Right. It's got two cameras in it. And. Uh, wow. If you don't lose it now. <laughs> the best part, it has the foam protecting, so even if it does get away yep. on us, we're going to be fine. Look at that. Way it comes. Okay. Okay, just push one button to land it, and there we go, safely. Okay, perfect. And then we'll have Tyler, go ahead, and you can We've got show the, us how the, oh, look at that little guy. Little monster truck, <laughs> controlled with your eye device as well. <laughs> That is so cute. Now that now that is house safe, right? That's not going to That's house safe. Problem. Yes, yes. No problems there. And you, like you were saying, so all of these devices that you have in here, we're going to show us the helicopter as well. They're yep. all controlled by the iPad Touch, the iPod I, Touch, iPod Touch, the iPad, as well uh, as the iPad iPhone and the iPhone. Yeah. Unbelievable. All right, that's some fancy driving there, Ty. <laughs> we don't want to step on. Okay, let's come on over here now, and we'll talk about the the helicopter because that's a good-looking toy as well. Yeah, we got a real helicopter here. It's it's a little bit harder to fly than the drone, but it's uh, it's good for kids age 14 and up. 
Adults love it too, and it works off your iDevice as well. Kids of all ages. Kids what of are all there, ages. What other you games do we have here that also like, we can look forward to here in this new year? Yeah, we got joysticks for your Mac if you got games that use joysticks. And uh, we've got some other stuff as well. We've got software for your Mac. Uh, a lot of adult games. We've got card games, uh, first person shooter games, and we've also got kids' games and uh, learning kids' games from. Um, Cat in the Hat and the Dr. Seuss. I see cat. the Green Eggs and Ham. Yeah, of Green course, Eggs and Ham. That's hands. a popular one for the kids. Monopoly, Roller Coaster, Battlefield from 1942. So there you have. We have all kinds of great games and devices for the kids. And yeah, kids, if you want to be the real apple of your teacher's eye, how about getting them uh, one of these? I'm sure they'll really enjoy it. All right, coming up a little bit later on, we're going to play some music for you. Yes, some portable music creation. We're going to put. Uh, Tyler to the test, see if you can give us some sweet tunes on this Tuesday morning. This is Morning Live. Tonight I celebrate the fact that I'm alive. We're going to check entertainment news. We'll tell you what Betty White has planned for her 90th birthday. And Colin Mockery is putting the finishing touches on a new book. With a cool new twist. Yeah. <laughs> So much to do when it comes to Apple, whether it be a learning device, playing games, and how about a little bit of music? Yes, even some music. I mean, no matter what, you want to get some beats going on, how about... Got the beats going on, so we're going to have Tyler join us in a second. In fact, Tyler says, never mind after the break, I want to play some tunes right now. So here is Tyler Lucas. He's going to play us the break right here on Morning Live. In Port Wando. At Creative Technology. Hey, Jason. Guys, the crowd's going crazy here. They're loving this morning show, which is, which is nice to hear. Yes, we're still inside Creative Technology. So much to do here at the Apple Store. All right, guys, keep it down. We're going to do a little music now with Tyler uh, Lucas. Yep. And Tyler, I mean, you don't have to be musically inclined to get this done. Not do at all. It could be your first day with your Mac, and if you, you want to try and play the piano with some drums or something like that, it's easier for it to get going. Uh, you just crack open GarageBand. Like I was saying, it's included on every Mac. Right. Uh, you just plug in. Uh, what I have here is just a simple interface to plug my guitar in. I can do some simple chords here. And I can have a myriad of different uh, uh, amps and such if I want a different sound. Uh, so let's just go here. If I want a dream pop kind of sound here, I can just do some little psychedelic, maybe some Woodstock stuff right there for you. You can actually put together <laughs> a complete song through Very this much program, so. Right? You, you can have multiple tracks. You, uh, so you can have a guitar with the dream pop. You can have the drums underneath, vocals on the top. Just get that whole vibe. We've also got stuff here. Uh, you can uh, have GarageBand on your iPad now as well. Uh, but we also sell a, a huge selection of different music stuff. Uh, we can plug stuff. Uh, you can plug your own guitar into your iPad or iPhone, for that matter. Now the kids are uh, are at home right now, going, "Mom, Dad, get me one of these." Exactly. Game is how pricey is this? Not so much. You can start off uh, anywhere from fifty to one hundred twenty dollars. Right. Even just so it's affordable. Your, very much so. Right. Um, and. Just you were talking about some of the Yeah, so uh, here's another interface we have if you want to plug your uh, guitar into uh, your Mac. Uh, it's a Fender bass, and that one there starts about 135, and it comes with uh, different uh, Fender authentic sounds as well. Uh, so it's simple to just plug in and go. Again, you can use this with GarageBand and use all the amp amps that are set in there as well. Uh, we've also got ones for uh, plugging into your actual iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad as well. So you can get some tunage there and have your own little portable amplifier. Uh, microphone as well. If you're a vocalist, you can record some uh, some choruses and whatnot. Wow, <laughs> this is this is this is incredible stuff. So now you're gonna. How about you play some For music sure. here as Let's we get to serenade Bob? Yeah, you can serenade Bob. Bob loves getting serenaded. So you go ahead and do that, and uh, Bob now will send it back to you with the music, courtesy of Lucas in the background. <laughs> the Lucas tunes. Hey, it's thanks, uh, Jason. It's Family Matters time. All right, that's coming up. I'm Jason Portwondo. We're still inside Creative Technology. The focus will be on the iPad. There is so much to do. Sandy will explain just exactly what we can do. If I want to check out the traffic like Jacqueline, I can show you that all the red spots here. Yeah, Jackie, that's traffic, but that's Toronto. We expect that. And one more quick thing here as we go to break. 
How about the fishies? Aren't they so cute? And if you put your finger there, you know, they'll, they'll eventually come and just like feeding the fish. Sandy Hall joins us after the break from Inside Creative Technology.